stand for the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated. Happy birthday to the following. For art today, fourth grade students don't need to bring anything. Fifth grade students, please bring your art shirts for clay. PBIS is definitely something that you've heard at school from your teachers on announcements and assemblies. But what does it really mean? You might be surprised, but you already know. It's just our school rules and how we act when we're here at OFIS. PBIS is all about being safe respectful, responsible, and kind. And really, that's it. It's important that we are always safe, respectful, and responsible and kind so everyone feels welcome and safe here at OFIS and we can work on being the best people we possibly can. Bulldog bucks are one way that we reward students for being safe, respectful, and responsible and kind. So keep up the good work. When you earn a bulldog buck, you can use these in our school store, the Dollar Dog, or use them in raffles in the cafeteria. Keep an eye out on the Bulldog Broadcast for more information about this. We will be focusing on one part of our PBIS school rules each month. We're excited to see you guys practice and show off how you're respectful, responsible, safe, and kind every day. Thanks for listening, and have a great year, Bulldogs. Hello, OFIS Bulldogs. This week is Start With Hello Week, a youth violence prevention program from Sandy Hook Promise with a mission of connecting people to form healthy, supportive relationships. Today you will learn how to create a closer, more connected, and inclusive classroom, school, and community. Simply start with hello. We have all experienced times where we have felt lonely, passed over, excluded, invisible, isolated, shut off, or ignored. Now imagine living like that every day or for multiple days or weeks. In every school and community, there are kids and young adults who are alone and quietly suffer through each day. We need to create a community that supports and out for one another. To do this, we need you. It is the only way to achieve this. And the good news is that this is simple to do. Just start with hello. Here are three easy, simple steps. Step one, see someone alone. Two, reach out and help. Step three, start with hello. So how do you know if someone is isolated? You need to know the signs and signals of isolation. Preference to be alone rather than engaging with peers. May avoid human interaction. Anxious or uncomfortable around others socially. Purposefully being excluded by peers, digitally or indirectly person is slightly removed or outside of you and your group. Unfortunately, you can see social isolation everywhere. The key is to look for it and observe. It's really important to remember that someone can feel alone even when they are with others. Isolation isn't always when someone is physically by themselves. After we observe someone feeling alone or isolated, we can reach out and help. For many, taking a step can be very hard what to do or when to reach out. So what can you do? Go sit next to someone who you believe may be feeling isolated. Your presence alone begins the connection. You can leave a note. You can invite someone to join you. You can even reach out on social media and connect with someone digitally. You have now reached out and helped. What do you say? How do you start a conversation? And learn more about the person you reached out to. What questions can you ask? What icebreakers can you use? The 
five W's give you endless options in how to ask questions. Who, what, when, where, and why are all great conversation starters. So why should you start with hello? You should start with hello to create a more connected and inclusive school and community. You should start with hello to inspire others and create lifelong friendships. You should start with hello to make a difference in someone's life. And lastly, you should start with hello because it's the bulldog way. Be safe, be respectful, be responsible, be kind. Hello Bulldogs, today is Meet and Greet Monday for Start With Hello Week. Find your hello style. Focus on greeting people you know and don't know yet here at Office. Smile, wave, say hello or good morning. A high five, fist bump, handshake. Be creative. Hope you have a great day. Remember that tomorrow, Tuesday, is Wear Positive Messaging Clothing, 